Room, the Elite Season 3 trailer, but holy shit, there's no English subtitle, so I don't know what's going on again. Crunchyroll should have it out with subtitles, but they're late as fuck. Let's see what this one's about. Something about D class and the C class maybe working together, going to the mountains training camp, right? Okay, the subtitles here, this is auto translate, by the way. I, I tried my best, guys. I tried my best to give you some context, but the fucking auto translate is calling Ayano Koji Ayashi and his friends. So, okay, Ayano Koji and his friends are going to do what? By the way, Yukimura right here. Recently, I've been re editing the Classroom of the Elite Season 2 video reactions. Yukimura is goaded. Glasses here is an actual Giga Chad. This girl right here, Sakura, what is her purpose in life? Why does she exist? There is no reason for her to exist. She's fulfilled her purpose in season one by being the fucking cameraman. And now she exists only to simp for Koji. And it's kind of sad. Her, 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 like, I'm sure she's important later in the light novel, but right now, like, what is the point of her character? Manabu? We got Gilgamesh, right? We got Gilgamesh right over here, which is going to be the next president. Acknowledged by Manabu, so you know this guy's next level. And I believe in season two, he said that he wants to set up a meritocracy so that everybody can rise up to their own competence and their own class cannot bring them down, which is an interesting structure. Is Koenji gonna do anything? <laughs> Judging by this, Koenji is laughing, crossed arms, giga chat as usual, and you see this guy in the corner getting angry. I'm gonna guess Koenji. Will fucking tease me again, just as he's done in season one and two. Maybe he'll do something. Maybe he won't. Most likely he won't. But please, if you give me a cool Koenji moment in season three, I will pop the fuck off. I think Ichinose is a prime focus, along with Sakayanagi Arisu, because in the trailer, Arisu specifically said everybody has two sides to them. And then, we know this was Sakura, but Ichinose, does she also have a second side? Beyond her bubbly, sunshine attitude, right? Does she have another side? Also, Arisu wants to break down Class C first, right? Arisu said, D class is not my priority right now. I'm going against C class first. <laughs> Best friends, right? <laughs> you, got, you, got, you got Sakura? The happiest girl ever? <laughs> and her best friend, Suzune? I don't know where they're going with this in the anime. Is, is there a redemption arc for Sakura? I don't know. Maybe these two are gonna be sisters of the moon, man. Meaning they, they might actually become really good teammates even though they fucking hate each other in the future. Who knows? See. Sorry, did I just say Sakura? I said Kushida. And I think Kushida is actually better than Sakura in terms of a character in the show, guys. And you are delusional if you think Sakura has added to the story more than Kushida has done. Season 2, Sakura Kushida fucking sucks. She is a fucking villain, but... She actually adds to the story, unlike Sakura, who sits there and exists just to simp. Okay. This girl right here is kind of new, right? I think this is more of like Ichinose's harem, right? Ichinose's harem, we have that. He this is different girl too, Hiyori, which is the book girl from Riwin's class. And this is the different times that's going to air, right? January 3rd, 4th, we will definitely react to this live. I don't think there's any more left to this trailer, but this scene right here, this is a funny scene. And this is what I keep saying. Arisu acts like she's so fucking tough. But look at this shit. She just falls. What the fuck are you without your walking cane? You always have an entourage of people, but are you really that good? What if I just tuck and take that walking cane away? Who would win, guys? If Riwin just sent Albert after <laughs> Arisu and broke her other leg, she'd be nothing then again. She has her bodyguards for a reason, right? There's like the top knot, you know, the blonde guy too. But yeah, another trailer. There might be a Crunchyroll trailer too with actual English subtitles. So we might check that out as well. But that's it for me. January 4th, be there. We'll be watching.